I grew up in the Philippines and the Philippines is a country that experiences an enormous number of natural disasters on a regular basis, in addition to having, you know, like a really chaotic political system. So growing up, you know, like I lived through a dictatorship up until I was eight. I, you know, lived through five coup attempts, you know, like during that entire period, you know, like a couple of volcanic eruptions, you know, like one major earthquake, you know, like dozens of typhoons, right? And I think that um, having that experience definitely helps me in order to really, um, you know, to have some emotional tools, right? Like one of the things that I talked a lot about on Twitter is that you shouldn't feel guilty for laughing or for having moments of levity and having fun because those are the moments that would allow you to reinvigorate yourself, to be able to help people later, to be able to have the emotional space to, you know, because, because if we exhaust ourselves, you know, like being sad and crying and, you know, like despairing all the time, then it actually doesn't, you know, like it ultimately doesn't help us. And it also doesn't help the communities that we're trying to serve. And, you know, like, and it is really true that for me, helping people is just as invigorating to me as, you know, like I hope the help is to other people. And that's, you know, like that's been a really important part of my, you know, coping with the crisis that we're in. Yeah.